People with diabetes can drink alcohol, and whether you decide to drink or how much you drink will be your personal choice. The questions to consider are, how will the different types and quantities of alcohol affect my sugar levels? Do I need to be careful about the calorific quantity of alcohol? How careful do I need to be about the other health risks associated? Different types of alcohol will affect people in different ways, and this is largely based on the carbohydrate content of each type. Beer has a tendency to push sugar levels up, particularly if you have more than a single pint. Wines tend to have less carbohydrate than beers, so will usually have a less pronounced effect on blood sugar levels. Spirits, such as whiskey, vodka, gin and rum, have no significant carbs in, and therefore shouldn't push blood sugar levels up. If you have them with a mixer though, this will need to be taken into account. An important point to mention about alcohol is the sugar level crash that can happen, particularly overnight. Alcohol can stop the liver from being able to raise blood sugar levels, and therefore quite a lot of people with diabetes find that after drinking, their blood sugar levels begin to drop. People who take diabetic medication, particularly insulin, need to be aware of this and may need to make dosage adjustments in order to prevent hyperglycemia. Ask your health team if you're unsure of what changes to make. Alcohol has a significant number of calories, and so if you're watching your weight, you may choose to limit your alcohol intake. Alcohol can cause damage to organs such as the liver, heart, pancreas, and even the skin. As people with diabetes are more susceptible to organ damage, you may want to limit your alcohol intake for this reason.